Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Dub Dub. Today's video is going to be unboxing Ipsy Glam Bag Ultimate. Woo! And at the end of the video, I'm going to do a little try on portion, um, trying to incorporate as many of the products as I possibly can. Ipsy Glam Bag Ultimate is a $50 monthly beauty subscription, and I think you get somewhere around eight full size items and I think five deluxe size items. Give or take, right when you open it up, you get a bag on top. I took it upon myself to put all of the items in the bag. This is the only item that didn't fit. And this month's bag for February is a velvet, super soft. It has some quilting to it. And of course we have our purple zipper with our Ipsy logo on it. Right on top you get this little pamphlet card. This month's theme is Feel the Love. Usually these have a list of the items along with a description and their retail prices. But for some reason the past couple months they don't. So I will be reading my descriptions and getting my retail prices from the Ipsy app. So the first thing I'm going to start with is the item that didn't fit inside the bag. Feel Harmony Rose Petal Facial Mask. It's an ultra concentrated toning gel. Hmm. How to use. Cleanse your face with warm water and dry thoroughly. Apply the mask to your dry face. Leave on for 10 minutes. Rinse off and dry face. Whoa, right when you open it, it's kind of freaky looking. It's this brown jelly like, oh, texture. It kind of looks like some type of sauce that you would dip your shrimp into. As expected, it has a rose scent to it and it has this jelly like consistency. There it is on my finger. I don't know. I feel like this is a strange thing to put on your face, but when I'm putting it on, it feels watery and it seems to thin out. But it feels, it feels actually pretty nice on my hand here. You get a pretty hefty amount in here. Of course, this is full size. And this is supposed to retail for $55. So I'm going to open up my bag. And the first thing I pull out here, Catherine Malandrino Dream Fragrance. Oh, is this a perfume? This is my first perfume that I've gotten. Oh. It says it has floral middle notes of magnolia, lavender, and peony are equal parts soft and sweet. Warm bottom notes of ambrette, tonka, musk, and vanilla add a cozy feel. Ooh, I was afraid I wouldn't like it. One whiff reveals the fruity top notes of apple, rhubarb, and nectarine that smell crisp and refreshing. I'm usually not fond of floral scents, but the fruitiness with the floral and the vanilla. Ooh, it smells good. I actually like it. And this is a deluxe sample, 10 milliliters or 0.34 fluid ounces. And the value of the full size version of this is $80. So this is an expensive one, but it smells good. I'm glad I like it. I can't wait to wear it. Next item in the bag. Of course, a brush set. The Shayna B Eyes on Miami brush set. And it comes with five different brushes. There's one for blending, smudging, concealing, shading, and crease work. Allows you to create endless double tap worthy looks. I'm excited to have these in my collection. I could always use some new brushes. And they value at $60. Next item is this Folly Fire Matte Manipulation Creamy Matte Lipstick in Sunset Boulevard. And it's a pretty pinky color. I usually don't go for pinks, but we shall see in the try-on. And this is a full-size lipstick and it's supposed to retail for $15. Next item is Tristique All Over Starlighter Powder Stick in Ultraviolet. Here's the packaging. We've gotten items from this brand before and they all seem to have this little pencil packaging going on. But here it is. It seems to be a highlighter. Yes, use it as a highlight, eyeshadow, or lip topper. This stick can multitask. The twist up stick design eliminates the need for a brush, creating more room in your makeup bag. You just put it on like this. It's a pretty color, it's a very purple, but it just seems like too white to be a highlighter on different angles. Like when it's not catching the light, it seems to leave like a white cast. So it'd be more for maybe an eyeshadow or I guess, oh, I see. If I sheer it out with my finger, then it doesn't cast as much of a whiteness, but it's still kind of. 
we'll see. We'll see how it performs on the face. And this is also full size, and this is valued at $18. Next, Avet Water Flash Coconut Water Cream. It's loaded with two super hydrators, hyaluronic acid, and pure coconut water straight from Hawaii, which helps balance your skin's moisture levels. Basically, a moisturizer, and it seems to have a nice consistency. Ooh, it's like it has a very subtle, nice, fresh scent to it. It's not too strong or overwhelming, but it's enough to be there. Obviously, this is a sample size, and I don't have any information on the app about the full size or any pricing. Next item is this Violet Voss Berry Burst. And I actually already own this fun size eyeshadow palette. I'm not sure if I received it in Ipsy before or boxy charm but when i do the try on i'll just use the one that i already own um i don't want to open it but this is the same brand but it's a different palette but look how similar the colors are i swear the whole top row is the same but the bottom row just varies slightly but it's super weird that it's different palettes but looks very similar but anyway i'll be using this one in the try on portion because it's already opened so I can give this to someone else. And this is considered to be full size and value at $18. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, I thought it said pink volumizing mascara. I kind of got really excited, but it says punk. And the color is black. This is the Duce or Duce. D-O-U-C-C-E. Duce? 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 <laughs> this is the punk volumizer mascara in black let's check out this wand and it seems to have a pretty wet consistency which i appreciate with my mascaras and it looks like it has a nice fluffy brush there and it seems to be a full size and it says that it's retails for 24 dollars next item is by Tula Cult Classic Purifying Face Cleanser. And it says it's loaded with healthy ingredients including chicory root, a natural anti-inflammatory, antioxidant rich turmeric root and blueberry, and probiotics to hydrate. And this looks like it's another sample size that doesn't have any pricing information on it. A couple more things we got here. Another sample sized item. This is the Caliste Better Bean Clean Face Coffee Cleanser. So another face cleanser. Hero ingredient, coffea Ara arabica, arabica? AKA organic green coffee is the ultimate glow getter. It boosts circulation, reduces inflammation, and is rich in antioxidants to help reverse signs of sun damage and aging. And this is the deluxe sample, and the full size version of this has a value of $21.95. Next item, this is this noisy box. It's super cute with the rainbow on it. Nature's Cartel Eyeshadow Trio in Champagne, Scandal, Tan Lines from Tahiti, and 90s Nude. Champagne Scandal. Here's 90s Nude. And the darkest one is Tan Lines from Tahiti. So that's a nice glowy, shimmery, glossy looking lid set we have there. This is a full size set valued at $28. And we have one last item in our Glam Bag Ultimate and it is the Rose Quartz Facial Moisturizer by the brand Grace and Stella. Every time you roll it back and forth over your skin, you treat your face to a gentle massage that helps boost circulation, reduces puffiness, and can help the appearance of fine lines. Facial rolling will help your serums and facial oils to really absorb into your skin so they work their absolute best. And this is full size and it's supposed to retail for $29. I'm not going to open this. I think the whole face rollers type of things like this, they are kind of gimmicky. So I don't know. It's just not for me. I don't think it really does anything or helps with anything. So I'm just going to leave this in its packaging and probably pass it along to someone else. That's the last item in the bag. So all these goodies here add up to a retail total value of over this much money. 
cha-ching, which is well worth the $50 that you pay for this month's bag. So now we're going to move on into that try-on portion I promised you. I think I'm gonna go for a Valentine's Day look. Aww. And I brought some pearls to play around with to go with my pearl earrings and my pearl hair clip and to stick with this whole Valentine's Day theme we have going on. Let's start with this perfume. Then I'm going to put more on. Woo! It smells so good. So that was my Catherine Malandrino Dream perfume. Didn't I get a moisturizer? Yeah, I'm gonna put on my Water Flash Coconut to Water Cream. But not too much. And here is my final look for this month's Ipsy Glam Bag Ultimate. I like it a lot. I'm digging the pearl freckles. And I really am happy with this month's box. I think my favorite item that I was most excited about is the perfume. It smells so good and it's the first time I've gotten a perfume in a subscription box. And I've been wanting one for a while, but I was also scared that I wouldn't like the scent. But I really ended up liking the scent a lot. That's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. If you're interested in signing up for Ipsy, I'll leave a referral link down below in the description box. And if you are interested in watching any other unboxing videos, I will leave some right here. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye. <coughs>